looks like I just bought seven years bad luck. Speaking of bad luck, it's time for another nasty little terror tale from my crawly collection. And this one's got a message too. It's a story about greed. And a girl who learned that beauty is only sin deep. <laughs> oh, want a date? Oh, thanks. <laughs> get off these streets and retire to the Bahamas. Yeah. Well, this place is my meal ticket, honey. I'm cold. Let's go get some coffee. I don't know about you, but my shit's always hot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Here comes Mr. Trump. Hey, baby. Huh? How's business? Cat's meow. How about you, sweet thing? Hmm? Pretty girl like you could use a manager. You hear where I'm at? Yeah, well, don't do me any favors, honey. Yeah, uh, just talking business, sweet thing. I'm gonna say this once. You touch me again, I'll shoot your tip off. Well, you listen up, little girl. This is grown-up time out here. You want to have an attitude? You might need some protection. Yeah, pretty girl like you could get ugly real fast with an attitude. You hear where I'm at? Sweet thing. <laughs> shit. Real smooth. You keep that shit up and you ain't gonna last another night out here. Yeah, well, what makes you think I wanna last another night out here? Well, girlfriend, where else you think you got the right to be, huh? Mm. <laughs> well, 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 well. If it isn't Mr. GQ. I tell you, for the rich, every night's a party night. Dream on, honey, cause ain't nobody invited you. What she got that I ain't got? Him. Not for long, she don't. All right, I'm from Missouri, honey. Show me. Mm -hmm. You check this shit out. So mean. Don't worry about it. How about a little sugar for Pimp Daddy here? Mm -hmm. mm. 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 So, uh, you want to talk a little business? That's right. Strictly business. Hey, w w what's up, baby? Give me your jewelry. You got to be crazy. Give me the fucking jewelry, man! Yeah, yeah, o okay. Yeah. Look, now you know you're never gonna get away with this. And the watch. Oh, baby, not the watch, please. What is this? Let's make a fucking deal. Give me the watch. Or don't you see where I'm at? Yeah, yeah, I, I see where you're at. Here, here. Just be cool. Ah! 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 Like I said, strictly business. Raven, you're freelance now, honey. No shit. Did you say you got this stuff? Some point to mine had a, a little accident. Truck ran over his head.
I didn't know you was a teen idol. So how does this work? I got two months or something to redeem my stuff? Hmm? You've got four months, plus 12%. If I, if I was going to take it. What's that supposed to mean? It means that if this watch was any hotter, I'd have burned a hole in my hand. I mean, a guy needs uh, asbestos gloves, some of the shit that people bring in here. Well, what are you talking about? It's a $15,000 watch. Look at the diamonds. It's hot. It's hot is what it is. You fry a big old egg on the son of a bitch. I, I, I don't want to buy your jewelry. I ain't buying your jewelry. And I ain't buying your bullshit story. Now get out of here. Yeah, fuck you. No, no, wait. Wait. I thought you weren't interested. I ain't interested in them things. But I can see you got something that's worth a whole lot more. Sorry, old man. I just retired from that business. No, no, no. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about your beauty. My beauty? Silly me. What was I thinking? <laughs> you, you, you wait. You wait. You wait. Let me get this straight. For 10 grand, you make a mold of my face? Not, not your face, your beauty. Yeah, right. And I got uh, four months to redeem my beauty if I want it back, huh? That's right. You know something, old man? There are people who play with the full deck, then there's you. Now, you hold still now. I hope you ain't claustrophobic. Almost time, my love. Almost time. Pretty soon, you'll be back with me. You'll look just like you did before. day we were married.
yourself. All this yours? Mm-hmm. Mm, life's tough. I get by. I don't want to tear you away from your guests. Well, I saw you, and let's just say something more important came up. Sounds like a cheap sexual innuendo to me. I'm sorry. It's supposed to sound like an expensive one. You don't think it's rude to leave your date? Go make a pass at another woman? Who's making a pass? We haven't even met yet. True. I'm Sylvia Vane. That's V-A-N-E as in weather. I'm Ronnie Price, as in everyone has theirs. Hmm. Don't look now, but I think Miss Clarell might be getting the wrong idea. I was kind of hoping the wrong idea might become the right idea. Hmm. What are you, a psycho? Just playing hard to get. Do you think it's a little rude to slap the host and leave without saying goodbye? Thank you very much, Mr. Price. You have a lovely apartment. Good night. Wait. I don't know the first thing about you. Please tell me why you came. We're both playing games. You know it, and I know it. The truth is, you do know the first thing about me. You knew the second I walked in the room, the second I walked through that door, that I'm the girl of your dreams, right? You want to get out of here? But you never ask. Nope, nope, correction. You are gorgeous. It's just real expensive jewelry. Mm. <laughs> Listen, I've been thinking. Remember what you said the night we met? That girl of my dream stuff? Mm-hmm. Well, let me tell you a little secret. You weren't lying. Even a little bit. <clears throat> Listen, I'll only be gone a couple of days. Probably end up sitting on the company jet signing papers. If I'm real lucky, I'll get to watch some fat Texans get drunk. <laughs> Won't that be exciting? Sweetheart, are you okay? I just dropped something. What is this, the makeup counter at Macy's? You're a knockout, for Christ's sakes. What do you need all this junk for? Well, I don't know. I got an acne flare-up or something. I feel like I'm in high school. Well, when I get back from my trip, we can go to the prom. What do you say? <laughs> hmm? Sweetheart? What, are you playing hard to get again? Come on, zip face. Give me a kiss goodbye. Please, sit down. Well, it does not appear to be cancer. I think we can say that first off. And I think we can also safely eliminate any pituitary disorder, specifically acromegalia, which, frankly, was my initial concern. Your medical record mm, doesn't indicate any history of uh, reconstructive surgery. Is that true? What are you calling me, a liar? Uh, no, 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 of course not. It, it's just that uh, silicon injections, implants, uh, that, that kind of procedure can sometimes result in the types of symptoms that you are displaying now, that's all. Oh. You, you see, uh, as I explained before, dermatology is my specialty, and your problem could be glandular. <laughs> 
But there are any number of specialists that I could recommend. Look, all I want is a simple answer to a simple question. What is happening to my face? Well, you're under a, a great deal of stress. Oh, you figured that out. Look at me. 48 hours ago, I could have had any man I wanted. Now I can't even get arrested. I'm 21 years old. What am I going to look like tomorrow? Miss Vane, if you'll just sit here for a moment, I will attempt to explain this to you. Um, frankly, your skin seems to be aging at an accelerating rate. Now, this does not mean that the situation is irreversible, but it's very important for you to try to think back to any time, let's say, within for the last six months or so, when you might have come into contact with a uh, toxic material, for example, uh, water, or gases, radiation, anything out of the ordinary, which could have caused this. Miss Vane? Here's my ticket. And 10 grand plus 12%. You didn't look at this too careful, did you? I told you the time limit was four months. Four months from this date is the fourth. Today's the fifth. Oh, son of a bitch. I'm sorry. Okay, how much? You missed the deadline, lady. I know I missed the fucking deadline. If you want to mark it up, mark it up. Just tell me how much. One hundred thousand. Hey, Joe. How's tricks? Hey, Mac. Ma'am. Four bits, you owe me. Yeah. Must be alpha time, huh? Don't move. I'll call the police. Yeah, I'd like to report a burglary. Go ahead. Yeah, address is <laughs> Sir, can you hear me? Who are you? Don't you recognize me, lover? I'm the girl of your dreams.
way she used to look. She used to be so beautiful. Now I need other women's beauty just to keep her that way. Small price to pay, I think. Look, I don't know what kind of crazy voodoo shit you're into, and I don't really care, but, but, but we had a deal, man. Look. All that's worth more than $100,000. Now I want it back! Give it back to me! I want my beauty back! Sure. Sure. I could do that. I could give you your beauty back. That's what you really want. Hey, Joe? Hey, Mac. How's tricks? Did you read that story in the paper? Yeah, I looked it over. Classic. Dumb broad. She stole every scrap of jewelry the guy bought for her. Then she offs the guy, leaves the murder weapon on the floor. Do you believe it? For her fingerprints on the gun. Not only that, they're already on record from a soliciting rap last year. You're not talking rocket scientists here. Mm. The second she shows her face anywhere, it's a one-way trip to the liquor chair. Huh. Have a face, too, huh? Oh, well. A face like that. Who needs brains? Where you going, you old, ugly, trifling bitch? She did. <laughs> Just goes to show you. If you want to sell yourself, take a look in the mirror first. 